Hello and welcome back to my channel. A few weeks ago I filmed a university morning routine so today I thought I would do the opposite and film my night routine on a typical day of university and I guess this is sort of like a winter edition so I hope you enjoy. Show me how to live love So tell me what you're thinking of I just want to firstly point out that everything I do from this point onwards is with the assumption that I have finished all of the university work that I needed to do that day. I personally focus a lot more and feel a lot more productive in the morning and earlier on in the day. So this is when I try to get all of my university and other work done. And that means when I come back in the evening, I have that time to just spend relaxing and doing anything else that I wanted to do. One of the first things that I do when I get home is make my room feel super cozy. So I close my curtains, I turn all of my Christmas lights on and my fairy lights, and then I get changed into something comfy. I was just out studying all of this day, so I was in a pretty comfy outfit anyway, but I just changed my jumper so I didn't get food on it when I was cooking. And then I also put away some clothes that I had drying out in pretty random places because I don't have a drying rack. I then refill my glass to make sure I'm staying hydrated and start cooking. I am normally so hungry when I get back. So I have dinner pretty early. It's normally around like six, seven-ish. I don't really know if that's early or not, but that's normally when I get hungry, especially with it being so dark outside right now. When I cook, I make enough to last me two or three meals. So most evenings, as you can see, I am just eating up leftovers. On this day I was heating up a leftover potato curry and I only found out after I'd filmed this that you're not really supposed to reheat potatoes. However, I think I must just reheat them enough because I've never had any problems and it's been just as good every day, but maybe don't try this at home. I don't wanna be responsible for anyone getting food poisoning. When I'm eating dinner, I have a browse of YouTube and catch up on some of my friends' videos or just watch anything on my YouTube recommended that stands out to me. And after I've finished, I will stick some music on. At the moment, the Adele album is my absolute go-to and I will try and clean up straight away because if I don't do it straight away, it just will not get done. However, as I mentioned in my morning routine, making sure that I have a clean room is pretty essential to me for making sure the next day runs smoothly. After I've done clearing up, I always make myself a cup of tea and Sid actually really kindly brought me some more Yorkshire tea from the UK. So this is what I'm having at the moment with a little bit of oat milk. And then I will take that over to my sofa where I do spend the rest of my evening. I'm not gonna lie, nothing productive happens past this point now. <laughs> I normally try and find something to watch on Netflix, but if you've got any Netflix recommendations, then please let me know because I am really strong struggling for what to watch at the moment. I often get sucked into social media, particularly TikTok at this time in the evening. So I will spend quite a lot of time on my phone in the evenings, which I know isn't good. So when I realize that I've been spending way too much time on it, I get myself back up and get myself ready for bed. So I take all my jewelry out, get changed into some super stylish pajamas, brush my hair out, and then head to the bathroom to do my evening skincare. Mm -hmm. 
Once I've finished with that, I will grab my book and get into bed. Reading is the last and probably one of the most important steps in my night routine because I find that it just really relaxes me and I'm actually really enjoying my book at the moment. So if you're looking for something new to read, then I would definitely recommend. And once I have got sleepy enough, I will set my alarm and then turn off my light and go to sleep. I really hope that you've enjoyed this video and if you have then make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and follow my social media which will be linked down below in the description. Bye guys! Bye.